For over 20 years, Fortinet has been a driving force in the evolution of cybersecurity. Their network security solutions are some of the most deployed, patented, and validated in the industry. With a pledge to train one million people in cybersecurity by 2026, they're looking for veterans and their spouses to train and hire. I always wanted to be in the military. I, I was in military school as a, a young boy. Uh, it was in my blood. My grandfather worked on the ships that would carry the supplies to Europe in World War II. My stepdad was a Marine. My first duty station was selected to be an avionics instructor internationally at the Inter-American Air Forces Academy in Lackland Air Force Base, Texas. Uh, we were helping countries in the South with their internal defense programs on all sorts of subjects, and, and mine was in the area of electronics. I went into the Air Force uh, right out of high school. I started as a uh, security policeman. I got the opportunity to go to uh, Germany. Uh, when I showed up, the, there was a wall. When I came home, there was no wall. I got back to the U.S., got stationed at Whiteman Air Force Base. Uh, I was guarding uh, the weapon storage area, nuclear weapons. Found that less exciting than what I anticipated going in and uh, cross-trained in a computer switching system specialist. That transition while in the service is actually uh, how I ended up in this career field. I had nothing going on after high school had no plans or any visions, and my cousin asked me to join the military with him, and I talked to the recruiter, took some tests, and left about two months later for the Marine Corps. I was an administrative admin clerk for four years, did two SPAC deployments on ship, and was getting ready to, to get out of the Marine Corps when I was offered to switch jobs. I chose a computer systems engineer, and I spent the next 16 years doing cybersecurity and computers. Military veterans are by nature problem solvers who understand the importance of maintaining a strong defense, especially when dealing with active threats. That's why Fortinet has made it their mission to help veterans transition from military service into the field of cybersecurity. Cybersecurity, in, in just a few words, is this. Think about how many devices you personally own that are connected to the internet. If you add all that up for just your family alone, you're gonna have a big number. Well, that expands the attack surface of everybody. Same thing happens at companies, happens at governments. Our job in cybersecurity is to protect those networks, protect those operations, and making sure that those companies and governments are resilient so when they're attacked, they can recover their services quickly. Our customers have different types of sensitive data depending on the vertical you're in. We're in our EBC center where we have you know, operational technologies where you can worry about critical infrastructure uh, like power and financial institutions, you know, the healthcare center, patient data. And there's adversaries who can uh, look to monetize that, the access to that data. For me, being a military member, transitioning was not easy, and I know it hasn't been easy for others. That's what makes this program, the Fortinet Veterans Program, unique. Uh, we work with other partner organizations to upskill veterans in terms of preparing their resume and mentoring, but we as Fortinet train them in cybersecurity. If we can't find them a job with us, we will find a job for them and help place them with one of our partners. So when I put my retirement paperwork in for the Marine Corps, uh, I learned very quickly that none of my resumes or job offers I had coming out were from anything I submitted online. It was from networking. Fortinet has a very, very broad outreach program, Fortinet Veterans Community Program, that reaches out to uh, veterans and their spouses to help them transition into the civilian workforce. They help them with soft skills, they help them with technical skills, and they really give them the opportunity to network and branch out. You know, don't limit yourself to the job title that you might have in the service. You know, those skills apply much, much more broadly than you might think they do. There are organizations uh, that are really interested in see seeing the success with other veterans. So I think believe hiring veterans into your organization, uh, like Fortinet does, they understand the value that we bring because, for one, our leadership, that's a given, and I think we all, we all have some of that built into us just from our, our time in service. Having the discipline and having the, the honesty and integrity, we're going to be there. We're going to show up and we're going to get it done.